Euro for about a week straight. Damn, you She got me a bacon and egg sandwich for breakfast. Can you see that? It's almost like being back in Britain. Bacon and egg sarnie. That's what we call them in England. Really, really good. We are Tamara and David, an Anglo-Balkan couple who live in a village in beautiful northern Bosnia and Herzegovina. Here on our channel, we take you along with us during our daily lives and also to the places we discover on our trips away. From everyday life to culture and food, we'll show you what it's like for us living in this much misunderstood country. We're looking forward to you joining us. Remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. Hello and welcome back to the vlog episode 14. We've had 14 of these. I didn't think we were going to get past six. Well, I did actually. Um, and thank you very much for all the comments um, that you've been sending uh, on YouTube, on Facebook, emails, Instagram, direct messages um, about the new style, the new format and um, how you like things. Life in the village is going on. We're now bouncing from really nice days like today. Chilly though, that's why I've got this puffer jacket on, um, to quite miserable days as well. And I think as we, uh, yeah, I think last night we got to minus. Don't know what it is now. How do you say that in North America? Negative. I think we were negative two last night, so that might have been minus two. But yeah, snow will be here in the fullness of time. <sighs> Not cold enough for uh, to record the breath. So yeah, thanks for everything so far. And let's crack on with this episode. The weather at the moment is up and down. It's all over the place, really. We go from beautiful sunny days to quite miserable ones like this. Um, and today we're driving off to Prinjavo, which is um, a large town not too far away from us, about 40 minutes drive, 40 minutes to an hour drive on the old road, but um, 20 minutes on the new motorway. And we're not gonna take the new road today. To drive to the old road, the road that goes from um, Black Tarshi via Klasnitsa up to Prinjavo is uh, very rural and we're going out um, on a road out of the village that we have never shown you on the vlogs before. We normally just drive down to the Banana Bridge. You must have probably seen that on many occasions. But this is um, the road that goes from our house up past the church and then down the hill on the other side. This is us going down the hill and we will join um, the road to Prinjavo. Miserable, cloudy, but nevertheless, it's really beautiful to live out here in the countryside um, and to show you as well, having the, the, op the ability to show you some of the area where we live. Welcome back to the vlog. It's a Saturday, special Saturday. It's 21st of November uh, in 2020. Uh, in 1995, that's 25 years ago today, in Dayton, Ohio, a long way away in the United States, um, the Dayton Peace Agreement was signed, which stopped the fighting here um, that had been going on since, I believe, early 1990s, 1991. But it finished in 1995. So today is a public holiday. We're going to go out and have a day with Tam's parents in town because it's her birthday on Monday and her dad's birthday today. So we're gonna have like a double birthday celebration, but it is still 
a very autumnal day. So the grass has all been cut down by the plum trees. These are all the plum trees that didn't give us a good harvest these past two years. They'll really be cut back, but the final tasks in the garden being carried out. And that used to be grapes. Isn't this refreshing? That sky. I just stood around here and I thought, God, I can smell alcohol. And it's still, the smell of the grapes is still coming. This is all the pulp that is now out of the barrel as the wine continues to ferment. Or rather, the grape juice changes into wine. I have this, uh, like, purple coloured, lavender coloured um, flask these days for the for coffee. So yeah, I know that uh, you're going to say, David, you drink too much coffee, but I do like it. It's one of life's little pleasures. Um, working at the moment, you most probably can't see on the screen behind but working on a new channel um, that you might like to check out. And um, we're still going to do some work, but if you uh, go into YouTube and search Virtual Bosnia and Herzegovina, I think we've got three videos up there at the moment. Um, the aim is to put like virtual tours uh, and just plain driving uh, videos. So when we're driving around the country, just put the camera on and take you on the drive with us and we put some chill out music or some lo-fi beats so um yeah in these days of continued corona and travel restrictions um at least you can go around the country with us or even when we go shopping um not every time will it be beautiful sun and shine we might have rain but um another channel that will give you the chance to to see where we live and to see how wonderful this country is uh, and on this channel, on the main channel, it's, it's stories about everyday life. So, yeah, like we are at the moment. Got to hurry up because um, we're going to be going into town for birthday celebrations. I don't think we're going to be filming. Got to leave a little bit of family privacy. I think you'll agree. <laughs> Birthday girl, well, Monday. Monday, two more days, and I'll be 46. <laughs> I'm bloody old. I know. Oh, I, sorry, I, I, I shouldn't have said that. You are not the one to say. For lunch, we are uh, getting a roast pork, I think. Roast pork? Yes. You look nice today. You're wearing your glasses. Thank you. I'm wearing my uh, lenses so I can wear the sunglasses. And today's a nice day. I mean, weather wise. Did you get what we needed? Yeah, no champagne though. No champagne? No, looks like the shop is closing. Made it just in time then? We did. No, I mean the shop is closing. There's no stuff inside. Empty, Empty shelves. Empty yeah. shelves.
So there you have it, episode 14 of the vlog wrapped up. We'll be back on YouTube at the same time uh, next week. We upload Fridays at 2200 Central European time. Uh, and then there's links on Facebook and Instagram and wherever. I don't know if you can hear. That's an egg beater. It's a helicopter uh, over at the airport uh, near Banyaluka Airport. The uh, local military have their helicopter unit and I can hear one coming. Maybe it'll fly over us. Who knows? And talking about aircraft, a little earlier on, the uh, bi-weekly flight from Gothenburg in Sweden arrived. So even in these COVID times, we are getting at least a few flights into Banyaluka Airport. Uh, every week. Please stay safe wherever you are in these challenging times. If you would like to subscribe to the channel that would be amazing. If you can give us a thumbs up press that button that's even better and the notification bell means that you don't have to worry about anything you just get an email telling you when the new one has been launched. I'm not going to put the uh, camera up because it's in the sun but I think you can hear the helicopter now. So, from the village, on a chilly day, as I say, stay safe and Tam and I will see you in the next one. Ciao for now.